family and we are on our way to Hyamore Farm. Normally I'm on the other side of the camera but for this weekend where all the family are going to take part in filming a special video vlog just for Hyamore Farm. So we love staying at Hyamore Farm. We have a caravan and we've stayed there many many times and we've had lots of lovely holidays. But this weekend we're actually going to stay in one of their luxury six-man pods and uh, Hyamore Farm have asked us if we'll do a review or a video and that's what we're doing. Okay, we're all unpacked now, had a lovely glass of wine and some dinner, and the pot is absolutely fantastic, and um, we'll give you a nice show round in, uh, in the morning. Night night. We had a fantastic night's sleep. The pod is so comfortable. The bed is enormous, and it's got a lovely curtain you can pull across, so it makes it really nice and dark and cosy and lovely and gorgeous. I'm just making some breakfast because the kitchen is amazing here. You've got the full hob, an oven, you've got microwave, you've got a massive fridge as well, which would easily have enough food there for six people. Really well stocked with plates, knives and forks and all that malarkey in there. And then also, what this is the great thing, you never know what you need to take when you go on to a self-catering holiday like this. Do you need to take a tea towel, washing up on all these little bits? No, nope, you don't because they provide it all. It's all in a little pack you get when you arrive and it's got tea bags in there, it's got coffee and sugar, washing up liquid, tea towel cloth, everything. So all you have to do when you come is bring your clothes, which is amazing. When you unpack, it will be amazing and everything's nice and stored away, which is what I always like. We were hoping for some lovely weather this weekend, but it hasn't happened. The weather is really rainy and horrible, but we don't care because this pod is so comfy and cosy. The heating is fantastic. And another little thing which I think makes this a really luxury pod is the lighting. The lighting is amazing. There really is different lighting in every single area, which means that you can really like turn the lighting down in the evening and have it lovely and bright during the day. A great feature of this pod is the decking out the front so when the weather is lovely you've just got a gorgeous vista of the campsite these pods are so well placed in the campsite that you've got that lovely decked area so when the sun is shining it must be just heavenly Part of the pod is the USB. The whole pod is very well designed. The uh, layout where this table turns into the bed 
and upstairs there's another bed and then the bed in the lounge area as well. Um, it just meant that we've all had loads of space so even though we've been indoors it's been just so incredibly comfortable. In the summer times at Highmore Farm they have the Vintage Marquee which is an amazing massive tent and it's fully licensed and they have these great bands and we've had just some brilliant evenings with all the family there haven't we over the years, it's been wonderful. Yeah it's brilliant, I think I, I also love the fact that they've got the, um, the food vans that come in so um, all the way through the summer they've got um, homemade pizzas, burgers in the mornings, they've got someone doing coffee and um, um, pancakes and stuff like that. One of the main reasons why we keep coming back to Highmore Farm is because of the team that work here and especially Daniel and Laura. They put so much of their heart and soul into this campsite like I have never seen a campsite run in this way before and we go, on, uh, go to a lot of caravan sites and campsites and so we've seen what other places do and we understand how much effort they all put into this campsite to make sure that you want to keep coming back. It is the best campsite that I've ever been to and I can't wait to keep coming back. So on site here there's a great shop. They have all the basic things that you might need like bread and milk. They also have a great range of gifts. So if you've got someone feeding the cat at home you can take them a lovely tin of Dorset biscuits. Um, all the food uh, that they provide there is a really high quality. A lot of it is locally sourced, so you really feel as if you're helping the local economy as well. It's well worth going to uh, if, you are, if you're staying in the, in the campsite. We've had a, a super weekend, despite the rain. The pod's been amazing to snuggle up in, We've had a fabulous time, can't wait to come back again.